It was nice. Uh, since I'm going to talking about the major associative skin, so I hope to do some uh, commutative algebra exercise so that we will use this fact. Okay, so the first one that is maybe is a little bit tricky, simple is the home is the left exact. Okay, so uh, our settings that everything is commutative ring with uni uh, identity, so uh, we need to show that if ABC is a module, so let's say this is a module. And then we are going to show that uh, the home M is uh, exact. So we get home of MA, home of MB, or home of MC are exact. Okay, so home is here, right? So if you have M to A, there are any map M, yeah, you can do the composition. So let's say this is U and V, so you can do this. Okay. So, and, uh, so this U star, right? This is V star. So U star is basically act on M will define to be just uh U circle M, right? So very simple, just composition. Okay, so we need to prove that this this guy is exact if the up, upper one is exact. Okay, so let's quickly go to the proof. Uh proof is simple. You should uh you should play around with it. I mean, you can play around with the algebra exercise if you are boring in your life, okay? Or you don't have girlfriend or something like that. Poor, poor me. Or maybe you have, uh, it's not poor me. So this is, okay, so that's first. So let's prove the first one is that U star is injective. Right, this is simple. This is almost trivial, right? Because if I take U star, I can also M map. Then I get the U circle M, right? So, which is zero. If I want to solve, let's say I want to solve U star M zero, I solve this, but this tell me that uh, M, right? But U is injective, right? So, because U is here, U is injective. So it tell me M is zero. So M is a zero map. So we prove that U star is injective. Okay, second, uh, we want to prove what? We want to prove that, uh, let's say this is V star. We want to prove that uh, the kernel of V star is the same as the image of U star. Okay, so the first one, which is one directions, which is simple. Uh, let's see. So one directions, which is simple is, okay, so one direction which are simple is basically the kernel is a, so image is a subset of kernel. Right? So this is, this one is simple. Okay, the reason is that uh right, so we can see that if we can take V star X on U star and then on some M that will become like uh UV uh V U F right V U F. Okay, so which is zero. So this tells you that uh right, so it's telling you the image of U star is a subset of kernel V star. Okay, so this direction is simple. So let's prove another direction. So another direction is a little bit tricky. Uh, it tests your understanding of algebra. So let's see this. So uh, hmm, how do we do this? Uh, okay, so let's let's draw a diagram like this. So we have A and uh, B and uh, C. And let's uh, say this guy is M. And uh, let's say this is map is F. Okay, so we take an element M here, and then we have F M here. Okay. So notice that uh, this is B, and then we know that the uh, let's say we take the element. So let's say we take F F element be, between uh in the sorry in the kernel V star. So basically, this tell me that the uh, the V F is zero. Okay. So this tell me that uh, if for any m, right, for any n, there f of m. f of m is an element, right? For any m, well, inside a kernel v, okay? Right, well, inside a kernel v. And, uh, but I know that kernel v is the image of u, right, by my construction. So I am I can find the element in a, right? So there is an element in a such that a u a, be the same as f of m. 
but use injective, right? So A will be unique. Right, use injective, so it will be unique. Okay, so now very simple that I can define another map that's called G. I can define G of M to be just to be just A. Okay, so obviously that G of M is A, then U A will be F of M, then it will F M. So diagram will commute. Okay, diagram will commute. Oh sorry, it should be here. Okay. So this tells me that uh, I can uh, this G is well defined and uh, it's unique. So this tells me that uh, basically this proof that another direction because uh, uh, if I take U and a G M right, well the same as F of M. So that means that uh, this F is in the kernel. This F right, is in the kernel V star. So that means the G is in the sorry. So that means that F, F is the U G, right? So F will be basically also belongs to the image of mu uh U star, right? Because there are already a function G such that uh, if you compose it with U, then you get the same function F. Okay, so this proves the other directions by just using this. So basically, the idea is simple, right? You just use the the exactness of the original one to try to pull into the left, the uh, the other one. Okay, see you guys next video.